I have a problem with putting others' opinions and need others' opinions and needs over my own. One thing I think you should consider, me personally thinking, is well, if you if the needs and what you want are not like very concrete it's really easy to kind of follow others more than you would do what you want to do yourself i guess i would say it's pretty common and like some things you would have opinions of stronger than other things too but i guess if you really want to how like yeah if you had to get through and do your own needs and stuff hmm I would say, first thing, if you could talk to someone, that would be the best case scenario. Saying that my needs and what I need to do is this, this, that. And especially if you talk with someone, that's when you really know what you need and what you want and what your opinions are, I'd say. And the thing is, if someone asks you for something that's very concrete and that's very, like, set in stone, that that is the thing that they want, right? Thank you for the gifted. So that definitely is like, they want this, period. And, and, um, and I feel like you would put those stuff over what you would want because you don't know what you want for yourself very concretely. And the stuff that other people say to you are very concrete, I think. What are we talking about? This person was saying that, uh, they put other people's opinions and needs over theirs, their own. Too selfless, I guess, in the end. And if you're saying if it beco it's becoming a problem, I mean, I don't know how dire of a problem it is. And if, if that's something that you don't want to do but are doing, like, because of like pressure and stuff i think the best thing is to well, well first of all talk about it with someone what specifically that is and if there's something that you really don't want to do try saying no for once i feel and then you'll learn that saying no is okay sometimes it doesn't have to be, even be a hard no it could be uh if it's like someone wanting to invite you to go out to eat or something and you're like sorry this time doesn't work out well for me it doesn't have to be a hard no you know i think the pressure kind of lies there too if it's difficult to say no then you know like you try to say no but it's not a direct no yeah and, and then if they don't get the hint then just be like oh sorry didn't read your message lamau if you if you did but then i'll start to think whether i would have lost a friend by the rejection if your friendship is that fragile to the point where you say no to one thing and they're not your friends anymore then i don't think that's a good friendship anyways in the first place. Just ghost them. <laughs>